gonna say you the one told me this shit. Believe in this and believe in that, man. That shit ain't real. We got to start learning what's real and what ain't real. Fuck what you believe in. Fuck how you feel. Fuck all that old sensitive shit. You got to start learning what the fuck real and what the fuck ain't real. Bottom line, dog. It ain't about whether somebody hurting your feelings if they telling you something. A motherfucker either telling you the truth or they goddamn lying. Bottom line, dog. And when these people telling you this shit they telling you about Christmas, bottom, bottom line, they lying, my nigga. They flat out motherfucking lying. When they telling you all this shit, they flat out motherfucking lying. But this one more crucial because they get so much money off the shit. This one, my man, please. Man, please. Motherfucker. It's since the day after Thanksgiving, motherfuckers been spending money on Christmas. Before that, really. But just I'm trying to be, you know, fair with you. Since the day after Christmas, since the day after Thanksgiving, motherfuckers been spending money on Christmas, dog. That's damn near what, from the 26th to the to the 25th. They done drug your ass down. 30 month, a month with this shit. <laughs> you know you done spent that goddamn ch air check you done got from then to now. You been breaking a piece off that motherfucker to go get some goddamn Christmas. But see, if somebody told you to do that same thing to go start some type of business... I'll start you some type of investment. Your silly ass will think you can't do it. You doing it anyway. You just ain't doing it to that. You would think you can't do it. You could have been done started your kids, all type of accounts and shit. That shit would have benefited their ass in the long run. Way more than that little shit you finna buy for them on some goddamn Christmas day. I promise your ass that. And they'd have been more grateful for that shit. They'd have got grown and realized that shit. They'd have been like, oh yeah, bet. I see what you was motherfucking doing. <laughs> I see. Shit, yeah, I was mad, but shit, I'm happy now. I see. I'm, I'm glad you did that shit. Straight up, dog, you ain't doing nothing. You just trying to fit in with some shit that ain't real in the first place. With some shit that ain't real in the goddamn first place. That's how sad it be. This shit don't even be real. Only reason it be real, because... They show you TV and all this shit and they pumping it on you. It's the fakest shit in the world, man. I mean, God damn. Ain't nothing they told you was real. Understand that. Christmas come out of thin air fucking with this man. <laughs> Christmas come out of thin air fucking with this man, man. It ain't, it don't serve us no good. It never have. What the fuck we gonna be celebrating a damn holiday in the middle of winter? And you black. And ain't no goddamn where you come from. And yes, you, I know you was born in America, motherfucker. When I say where you come from, you still from Africa, motherfucker. You can, I don't fuck if your ass was born. Where the fuck you born at? That, this blood gonna trace your ass back to Africa. So you are African, whether you understand that or not. And wasn't no goddamn uh, winter time over that motherfucker. Wasn't no Santa Claus. Wasn't no Christmas. Wasn't no Saint Nick. Wasn't no Jesus. Wasn't none of them people. See, so you're going to have to let that go. Well, nobody bringing no presents on the door, motherfucker. Hey, man, that's just how great. <laughs> he know when you're not a nice. Ain't that a bitch? You think them slaves, what you think the slaves was going through on Christmas? So you have to understand that shit. What Christmas is to you ain't what Christmas always done been, man. <laughs> they keep modifying that shit as time go long. It look like these days, it look like a little more people waking up, but for the, for the most part, people still caught up in that shit, stressed out by how they going, how I'm going to get this for this day, and trying to, you know, and then I understand, man, because you know, you know your kid, you want to, you trying to do it for your kids, I understand, you want your kids to be happy, but they going to be happy, they going to be happy. They gonna be happy, my nigga. They gonna be happy because you done been taken care of them. That's why they gonna be happy. If they got some sense, they know the one day ain't damn. You been feeding them all year. You that they gonna be mad you don't get them. <laughs> got so, if they don't get all the shit they want on, it's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right. You can't you can't think like that. I've been explaining that shit to my children. Hey man, I love y'all. I told my children, man, I love y'all. And, I, and you know, I understand y'all ain't got to feel how I feel. I, I, that ain't what it's about. I ain't gonna try to twist your arm. But look here, man. 
I don't fuck with this shit like this. I explained why and what my reasons for it being. I proved it. They seen it to be factual. But I told them like this. Yeah, man, y'all young. I ain't gonna, you know. I know it's hard for you because you see this shit all around you. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to break you off a little something. But I ain't I ain't never went uh, ass out for no motherfucking crook. Because I get a motherfucking shit all year anyway. They been getting shit they want all motherfucking, they whole damn life any motherfucking way. So Christmas ain't going <laughs> to, Christmas, Christmas, I can see if you ain't been able to get a motherfucking nothing all year. And you say, well, you know. I don't, you done saved up your little money and whatnot. I understand, but it's like you said, you could have still did better with that money. Don't fall sucker for no sentimental shit, no emotional ass day that ain't real and got you going broke for the motherfucker. We got to put it in to that shit. We done come too far, man. And we ain't gonna never turn the curve, be honest with you, if we keep fucking with this shit. We, as a people, we ain't gonna never turn the curve fucking with no crisp. So you still, you got to understand that. It's all right, my nigga. God damn, but you got to understand, that shit ain't the end all. I don't, hey, man. Like, a motherfucker got to tell me when Christmas going to be and all that shit. I don't even know when Christmas going to be. I'm unplugged, motherfucker. I've been unplugged from that shit. So you ain't going to have me all stressed out and, oh, my God, it's getting close and shit. Man, fuck that. Nigga, let that shit come and go so that shit can go and get the fuck off your mind. That pressure on your ass. Look how that shit got that pressure on. Stressed out in your own house by the fake ass holiday. <laughs> by the fake ass holiday. And it looked real because they keep showing you everybody doing the shit. You keep seeing it on TV. It looked real. It looked real. It do. It looked real. It looked real. But it ain't, it ain't real. It's an illusion. It's a goddamn illusion. That shit, man, please. That shit breaking our ass. And they be hitting you with them bitches bite to bite. They hit you with Halloween. Them the most, the, the most, uh, the three mo the three holidays we spend the most money on in a row. Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. They got them bitches bite to bite on your ass. Three months in a goddamn row. Breaking your ass going into the new year. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> and you don't give a fuck because they already got your mind conditioned that you finna get your motherfucking income tax. You see? And you gonna get that bitch and shit that over too. You, most of you motherfuckers. You motherfuckers gonna be buying rims and shit, man. <laughs> motherfuckers gonna be. And I ain't knocking it, my nigga. Each his own. I'm just saying. You gotta start thinking about it. You do something smart with your money. Do something with your money the way you ain't. You can be elevating, my nigga. Do, you supposed to be doing shit with that money. But see, they start coming with them commercials around that time. Start already programming your mind to buy some fuck shit before you even get the money. You see? And then you fall off that shit in your mind. As soon as you get your money, you go run by that shit you been hearing about. And they ain't really getting nothing you need. It's like, hey, man. Pimping out your children. Most of you motherfuckers pimping out your children for income tax. All kind of shit. But it's like, look, man, because you done went broke fucking with Chris. All that shit a result of being broke fucking with Chris. Coasting into the goddamn New Year. Broke his head. Motherfucker going to the New Year broke to the motherfucker. But you had what you wanted for that one day. That's what make you all right with. Fuck that. If I got to sacrifice one day to, to eat the rest of them days, fuck that one day. That would make logical sense. But see, when you got some type of emotional attachment to this one day, well, you might don't mind fucking up all your shit. For some shit this white man and told you. A nigga told me the shit on Chris. Shit on Chris.